standing out in the backyard. There's my back fence. Look over that way. There's a really, really large crepe myrtle that's beautiful. Here are some of the rock roses you can see. Uh, in fact, the hummingbird, check this out. There's a butterfly on one of them right now, but if I give them a little water, they, they love to sprout. I uh, want to just point out a couple of things, a couple of bird feeders. I want to tip my cap to my good friend, city manager of Cedar Hill, Greg Porter. Uh, he gave me that bird feeder and some uh, bird seed refills, those cylinders, kind of a cake, and it sits there. I, well, this morning I was watching the tufted titmouse and the Carolina chickadee. It's awesome to watch him do that. Uh, right there is the hummingbird feeder. This last weekend visited my sister-in-law, Joanna Bean, and she opened up a refrigerator out in the garage and there were several mason jars full of clear liquid. I said, what's that? She said, that's Bill's uh, syrup that he uses to refill the hummingbird feeder. I got his recipe and want to tip the cap to Bill and Joanna. Uh, the hummingbirds love uh, the recipe and they're really, really enjoying it. Um, Jesus said, consider the birds. There's a lot of lessons that we can learn from them. Uh, but two things I know uh, if you really want to see some birds, watch them up close, two things need to happen. Uh, one would be put out something that is attractive, something that attracts them. And so the nature of the feeders are such that they attract certain kinds of birds, whether it be the hummingbird or the songbirds. The other thing is I'm happy to feed them, put out something not only that is attractive, but that also is uh, helpful, beneficial, nutritious, and feeds them. Uh, there are a lot of lessons to be learned from the birds. And let me just say, uh, some of the things that we are drawn toward and that we move toward, it's always a good thing uh, when they actually help us, sustain us, and not hurt us. Hope you've had a wonderful day. God bless you. Have a good evening.